Now, Israel's war on Hamas has sparked suspected hate preaching in some of Britain's mosques. A talk TV investigation today reveals footage of preachers in several mosques calling for Jews to be killed and Israel to be destroyed. And we have handed the dossier of evidence to police and officers from three forces are now actively investigating. Holly Hudson has this exclusive report, which comes with a warning that some viewers may find its content offensive. A sermon at the Redbridge Islamic Centre in Ilford. The speaker prays with his congregation in Arabic to curse the Jews and the children of Israel. Talk TV had the recording translated twice independently. It's voiced by an actor. O oh Allah, curse the Jews and the children of Israel. O oh Allah, curse the infidels and the polytheists. O oh Allah, break their words, shake their feet, disperse and tear apart their unity, and ruin their houses and destroy their homes. And from London to Liverpool. If the two billion just marched on Israel, it's all over. The spot in the direction of Israel, two billion, it's all over. The to Birmingham. The stones, the stones will speak and say, oh Muslim, behind me there is a Yahudi, come and kill him. Preachers at mosques across Britain have been filmed calling for victory for Hamas. Oh God, heal our hearts regarding the usurping Jews and in every enemy of you and the Muslims. Oh God. Limit their number, kill them indiscriminately, and do not leave any of them alive. O oh God, our Lord, disperse them, weaken their strength, shake the ground beneath their feet, and freeze the blood in their veins. Make them captive to the Muslims. And stoking hatred against Jews and Israel with alarming anti-Semitic rhetoric. O oh, revenger, revenge from the oppressive aggressor occupying Zionists. O oh, Allah, Shake the earth beneath them. O oh Allah, limit their number. Kill them indiscriminately and do not leave any of them alive. Rhetoric that in some cases is as violent as that of Abu Hamza, the known hate preacher who delivered sermons at Finsbury Park Mosque before it was shut down and who was deported from the UK. In Greenwich, this speaker ended his prayers with calls for Allah to grant victory over the enemy. The Met said while it understands the footage raised concern in Greenwich, no offences had been committed there. Jewish groups, though, say that police aren't doing enough and are calling for prosecutions in some cases, warning that some of these sermons could lead not only to hate crime, but extremism and even terror. There is no difference between the rhetoric in the Hamas Charter and the rhetoric that is on display in these videos. They are utterly hateful, they are violent, and they are a threat to both Jews and non-Jews in this country. There is a real risk of more than just one person being encouraged by this rhetoric to go out and take action on the streets. And we've seen how bad that can be in the past. Talk TV has confirmed that police are assessing video evidence from four of the seven mosques we've highlighted. The Charities Commission is also examining some of the footage, as the majority are also linked to registered charities, meaning they receive taxpayers' money. In a statement, they said, we are aware of a significant number of serious concerns, which largely concern allegations of anti-Semitic or hate speech. We're assessing them, and if there has been any wrongdoing, we'll take action. Talk TV reached out to all of the mosques and figures featured in this report. Redbridge Islamic Centre declined to comment directly to us, but previously said it launched an immediate investigation and decided that the imam will not be allowed to address worshippers again until it's concluded. No other mosques responded.